To ensure that your app is optimized for mobile devices, it's important to test it in the same form factor as your users. We will do this by installing the Power Apps mobile app, which we'll cover in this lesson. We are going to demo it on an Android phone, but the procedure is the same across all types of phone types. I'll go ahead to the App Store, in this case Google Play, and search for Power Apps. I'll go ahead and install it. Once downloaded, we can go ahead and open it and sign in using your username and password. Now that we are signed in, we can see our school app. We'll go ahead and click on that. First, we are presented with some general instructions on using the app. And then we are presented with our first screen, the tutorial screen. I can scroll through the screens as previously demonstrated. If I press the Browse button, I am redirected to the Browse Students screen where I have the gallery listing of all student details. I'll go ahead and press the right arrow for Paul Smith, which brings me to the Details screen for that particular record. If I press the pen icon, I can edit the details for Paul Smith. As shown in the tutorial when opening the app, I can close the app by swiping to the right from the left edge of the screen. I'll go ahead and close it. When using apps in Power Apps Mobile, you get the most out of your device's capabilities. For example, you can use camera controls and GPS location in your apps. This allows you to take advantage of the full potential of your mobile device when using your apps. You now know how to access your apps on your mobile device using the Power Apps mobile app.